Welcome back to Good Morning Hawaii. We are in a butterfly encounter tent. We're so excited because we're just going to talk about the uh, the Na Ola Nakini Earth Day Ho'olaulea. So this is an exciting time. Just check out. I have I have wings and I am flapping with the butterflies this morning. You can see them all around me. My new best friends. Here they are. So here to talk about this very special event, we are going to introduce um, Pauline and Darlene. You guys yes. are going to talk about um, the the Ho'olalea the, the, at the Malama Learning Center. So yes. let's talk about what is exactly happening right now. Sure. Well, um, Darlene is with the, sharing the butterfly experience. It's one of the booths that will be at our Ho'olalea tomorrow at the Nanakuli Public Library. Uh, I'm with the Malama Learning Center and we're putting this event together for a number of reasons. One main one is to talk about what the students that we've been working with have learned about the environment and how we can take better care of it, especially in the Waianae area. But we also want the community to be able to learn about the environment in general and what they can do and how to appreciate Mother Earth. It's a great cause because it's all about the Ola Nakini, or Nish, Ola Nakini Initiative yes. and the, the Malama Learning Center. So this is an exciting time. What a great way for, for kids kids and adults alike to learn about butterflies exactly. and flapping away. And so Earth Day, is this is all in the celebration of Earth Day, which is an event happening tomorrow, right. I believe. Yes. Yes. So let's, let's talk about tomorrow's event, if that's okay. Yeah. And yeah. Pauline will tell you where it's yeah. at yeah. and what the hours are. Yeah, sure, yeah. So it's at um, Nanakuli. Cooley Public Library, Saturday, April 20th, 1030 to 230, and it's free. Uh, lots of activities. Oh lots my of goodness. What, so butterflies, what exactly do they symbolize? Because I know there's a lot more to them than people than people right. know. That butterfly likes you. It's, it's, <laughs> Butterflies are very symbolic because of the metamorphosis. So from the caterpillar to the chrysalis and out comes this beautiful butterfly. So it's change of life. Um, it, it, you know, butterflies are pollinators, so they're very important to our environment, just as the bees are. Ezra, and you were showing me pictures of a, a releasing of a butterfly at an event, and and you did see some of these actually fly in, um, onto onto some some cemetery grave sites. Is that right? Uh, when people release butterflies, for some reason, they resonate or they connect with certain people and so the butterflies when they're released they will fly directly to someone and stay with that someone and so it's kind of like um, it could be one of their loved ones coming back so it's very it's a very spiritual experience and at the event we will have caterpillars we'll have um, a learning center so people can hold on to caterpillars touch caterpillars um, and they can come in and feed the butterflies oh my gosh well that's so cool that is exciting we are connecting with our butterfly spirit animals yes. right now and as always we'll have more information we'll have a link to you guys on our website at kitv.com oh, thank you so much for joining us this morning we're we're so happy to be flying away and good morning Hawaii we'll be right back stay with us thank you thank you Lumber World, your destination.